Uh oh. Hey, what's up guys? Your boys Pilot 2 k 7 back for another Grand Theft Auto 5 real life mod video. Today we're starting off at our trucking shop and also construction shop. We haven't been in this area in a long time. If you guys do remember this shop, let me know by leaving a comment in the comment section. I'm just curious who remembers this shop here. But like I said, um, we're back with another episode here guys. This is where we keep most of our construction vehicles as you can see. Got some trucks and trailers over on that side, and we have more construction vehicles on this side. So let's go ahead and get today's episode started. Hope you guys are having a great day, and I appreciate you guys coming in to check out the video. And um, yeah, let's go ahead and get this episode started today, guys. Let's go, let's go. All right, so for today's episode, we're actually going to be transporting some pipes from... Los Santos to Polito Bay and we are going to be using this brand new Kenworth W900 this is by Foxtrot Delta and I will link it down below in the video description it's not a public release mod um, I got it by joining his patreon page so um, if you would like it you know you can check him out on patreon he makes a lot of cool mods and he also has a GTA 5 mods page as well with tons of free mods on there so I'll link both of them down below now this truck is a work in progress so it's not um, finished yet he's still working on it but it looks pretty nice and I figured we'll take it out today we'll show the uh, Kenworth W900 some love and I really like it it's a beautiful truck now we're gonna be using this flatbed trailer today guys and we're gonna be picking up some pipes loading it onto the trailer and then delivering it to Polito Bay so hopefully you guys do enjoy if you do make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button leave some comments down below and make sure you watch the end too so you can see um, the truck get loaded and then you'll see us unload and everything like that so let's hop inside our truck I'm gonna give you guys a quick look around like I said it is a work in progress truck so like the dashboard isn't finished yet, but still looks pretty nice in here. We also have the red interior as well. And a beautiful truck. Beautiful truck. Oh, look at our other truck over here. Ace Truck and Logistics. So, um, yeah, this location here, we pretty much use it for trucking as well as construction. And what happens is with a lot of the construction vehicles, we rent them out. So that's why we have the trucks here in case we got to, like, you know, rent them out and deliver them and stuff like that. So I'm going to try to get out of here without smashing this guy to my left here. Alright, let's see, can we get out of here? Yeah, I think we're good. Yep, we cleared him. Alright, so this is my first time driving a truck as well. So far, so good. I really am enjoying it. Nice to have a nice W900 in game as well. And also, guys, I know I actually missed Trucking Tuesday. Um, I forgot to um, upload, or I didn't get a chance to upload an American Truck Simulator video for Tuesday. And I try to do it on Tuesdays and Thursdays, but. I decided instead of um, doing American Truck Simulator today, we're going to do some American Truck Simulator mods within Grand Theft Auto 5. And by that I mean like this trailer I'm using, this trailer is actually from American Truck Simulator. So that's pretty cool. It has been converted over and I will link that down below in the video description. Is this light not working? Right, we'll make sure we take these turns nice and wide now this pickup location is going to be a little tricky here guys we're going to have to like back in and it's going to be tricky because we're on a hill but we got to back in there to pick up the pipes so let's figure out how we're going to get in there i forgot the name of this place uh what is it grand grand bank steel incorporated so that's where we're picking up these pipes from and I'm surprised there's no traffic, so let's try to park up before traffic comes in. Right as I say it. Alright, they're gonna hit me, so let's just turn traffic off for a minute. There we go. Alright, so I should just back it straight on up. Oh, 
little closer to this side that I wanted to be, but it should be okay. Alright guys, so there goes the uh, pipes right over there. We're going to wait to get loaded up. Let's take a look at our cargo really quickly. So, I guess not really pipes. I guess we should call these cylinders. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Alright, so they're all here. We're going to pick up these eight cylinders and load them up onto our truck. So, let's just wait until uh, we get loaded up and then we'll come back and get on the road. Alright guys, so just checking over our shipping manifest and everything looks good. So we have our eight cylinders and we're taking them to a Polito Bay construction site. Alright, so let's go ahead and get going. Make sure everything is secured. Got the tie downs, got also wood blocks holding everything down as well. And this is a really nice trailer pack. It comes with a couple different loads that we could have and um, yeah, I think I'm going to try to do it different load every week so if you guys do enjoy these trucking episodes definitely let me know by leaving a comment down below in the comment section also let me know which truck would you guys uh, like us to use in the next episode as well all right so let's hop back in and let's see it looks like we're gonna be getting straight onto the highway so that's good most of our driving today is gonna be highway driving so that's good as well also the trailer lights turn on those are really nice it probably look nice at night too. All right, let's uh, get going. Christ alive! That rollback was real right there. <laughs> All right, so we make this left and get onto the highway. about to get hit. Oh look, there goes another Kenworth. Uh, that's, uh, I think that's, what is that again? 660, 680, something like that? I forgot. Alright, so this should be a nice drive, guys. Shouldn't take us too long, um, since most of it's going to be highway driving, so we don't have to worry about red lights and stuff. I'm going to try to follow the traffic laws somewhat today, too. Um, normally, when I drive, I drive kind of crazy, but since we're, we're going to be on the highway today, we don't have to worry about red lights or anything, so we should be able to tra follow the traffic rules. I gotta get all the way over. Alright guys, so unfortunately my game crashed, but I was able to just reload everything. So we're gonna continue. Wait a minute, I just realized something. I didn't have to get off the highway here. GPS. I don't think I did, right? Could I have technically just stayed on and merged onto this? I don't know, sometimes GPS be tripping, man, just like in real life, you know? I should have installed a speedometer too, but I'm going to turn on the one that comes with the trainer. The only thing is really small, but if you guys look in the top right, you guys should see it. So right now I'm going 55. 
Just so we could keep track of our speed, make sure we're not going too, too fast. I wonder what our top speed with this thing is anyway, too. There's only one way to find out. Should we push it to the limit, guys? Let me know how fast you think this truck could go. And I'll see if we could get it up to that speed. Come on, man. Get out the passing lane if you ain't passing. Come on, you're only going 45. Speed limit is 60 here. Come on, man. I have to flash my lights at him. Those mud flaps are pretty nice too. We're going for it. I'm sorry I had to. I can't be driving 50 miles per hour. We gotta go. I thought it was gonna stop. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. I mean, I didn't. I thought he was gonna continue running. He literally just stopped and looked at our truck and died. Oh my God, roadkill, man. All right, let's get some RIPs in the chat. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna have to try to clean off his blood now. Oh man. I did not intend for that to happen at all. All right. Well, um, yeah. I'm going to have to keep pushing. I really thought he was going to keep running. Though. I didn't think he was going to stop. <laughs> I know 76 is way too fast for us right now. We are speeding. Yes, I know, I know, I know. It's okay, though. Alright, so I'm going to try to top it out on this stretch here. So we're up to 82. I don't think we're going to get... I don't think we're going to go any faster than, like, maybe 90 tops. But we got traffic, so I gotta slow down here. Oh, watch out there. Yeah, I don't think we're getting over 85, guys. I got the throttle all the way down, the pedal all the way down. And we're topping out here. Which is pretty good because I mean we really shouldn't be going any faster than this anything. Yeah, 
I got up here pretty quick though. Only one mile to go. Alright guys, so we are arriving in Polito Bay. And let's go ahead and drop off this load. So we made it here pretty much safely for the most part, no accidents. So that's good. Alright, so let's make our way inside of the construction site. See some of our trucks are out here already. Alright, so I'll double check, but I think they're going to use the excavator to unload this and place those cylinders down there. Hey right, guys, so that's where they wanted it. Let's take a quick look at the construction site while we wait for them to unload this thing. But they got a nice excavator down here. I do have to update the skin on this one. I know they did um, release a new update. We have a bulldozer, or dump trucks, another excavator, uh, cement trucks laying cement. And we also got some workers working, so let's make sure everybody's doing what they're supposed to be doing over here. Alright, so everything's looking good. These guys are under lunch break. Got the 3500 flatbed out here as well. They just dropped off some more supplies. So yeah, everything at the construction site is coming along nicely, guys. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button and leave some comments down below. We're going to get these cylinders uh, unloaded and placed down here. And um, yeah. Let me know what you guys would like to see in the next episode. See you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.